Congratulations, Tim. Thank and you very much. I appreciate thanks, that. Thanks for sitting down with us. No problem. Appreciate you guys. After being a finalist five other times, you're finally going to get that bronze bust in Canton. What did you feel when you heard that the sixth time was the charm that you were finally going to be inducted into the hall? You know, um, there were a couple years prior where I, I thought I had a better chance to, than, than getting in than this year. Um, so I wasn't too optimistic going into this year. When you look at the list of guys who were, who were on the list, I mean, there were a couple offensive linemen who could have gone first, first ballot uh, Hall of Fame, and they, they, did, they didn't do that. So I think from that standpoint, it became um, a matter of just being very grateful and very thankful about the position that you're in. Uh, but at the same time, understanding that this thing could go the other way. I told my, told my wife, I said, hey, look, if they put Marvin Harrison in this year before me, it's going to be a long wait. <laughs> so let's just, let's just understand this process and go from there. But uh, to get the uh, nod, man, was, uh, was an incredible moment and, you know, a moment I'll never forget for sure. Well, tell us about that moment. I mean, what, wh where were you when you got the call and who, does, who, the, who was the first person you gave the news to? I was, uh, I was in my room and I was expecting a call, but actually I got a knock at the door and it was big Dave Baker. If you know Dave, he covers the whole door. Uh, and uh, he started with this slow soliloquy about the Hall of Fame and how great it is. And, and he had cameras around him. Otherwise, I, I was about to say, hey, Dave, I hope you don't have these cameras around you and uh, about to tell me no. But uh, so it took him about two minutes to get to the good part. And uh, he finally said that, I'm a member of the uh, 2015 class, uh, Hall of Fame class. And uh, he was like, don't believe do not tell anybody. I was like, okay, close the door. I'm calling my mama right now. <laughs> so I, uh, I called my mom. My wife and my agent were in the room with me. So it was, it was a great moment. Were there uh, tears involved? How emotional did it get? It was waterworks. It was, uh, it was amazing. And, um, you know, to, you know, you hug your wife, you hug your kids, you hug your agent and get on the phone with your mom. And, uh, uh, you know, hear her scream like I've never heard her scream before. Uh, it was just a uh, emotional moment. 